All right, you gotta say uh, blitz. Blitz! 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 blitz. Yeah. Welcome to First Build, everybody, and welcome to Thursday Blitz. Now here at First Build, we are constantly working on new and exciting innovations for the home. But where do all these awesome ideas come from? Well, some of them come from you. That's right, the community. You sitting there watching this video, you can contribute right now. You can go to our co-creation page on our website and you can add ideas, you can toss us ideas, you can brainstorm with us, you can critique ideas, you can send us anything and we will look those over. Co-creation link in the description, go check it out. Also our YouTube comments are extremely helpful. People commenting what they want to see, how they feel about our projects, our ideas, the good, the bad, the ugly, let us know because we're trying to co-create with the community and serve you. So on this beautiful day, once a week, we get together, we blitz, we crank out new ideas, innovation, prototypes, just like that. It's amazing. You got to check it out. Let's get ready to blitz. <laughs> hey, my name's Allie. Um, so one cool thing about me is I make bread. Yeah. So I'm looking into making, starting making sourdough. Uh, but the one issue with that is I am terrified to make a starter. It's really hard to make and there's always that fear that you're going to miss a feeding and your yeast baby is going to die. So I'm working with making something that will automate the sourdough feedings that will measure when the bread is at its peak or the starter is at its peak and it will automatically feed the sourdough starter as soon as that peak stops, starts to like decrease a little bit. Blitz! Blitz! <laughs> video, oh, a charcuterie, so duck prosciutto maybe. Hey, I'm Jack Manzella. I am a charcuterie lover and dug up this old prototype in the back of First Build. Turns out we have a prototype of our charcuterie chamber that controls fresh air exchange, humidity, um, and airflow. And that's exactly what you need to cure your own meats at home. But the existing solutions are really expensive right now, or you have to kind of hack something together yourself. My mission over the next couple weeks is to figure out if anybody else wants to make their own charcuterie and maybe even cheese in the comfort of their home. We've got three different types of smiley faces and depending on the improvement you want to see or what you're thinking of for the retrospective, you got smiley, neutral, or sad. You don't want to be sad. You don't want to be sad. Today on Blitz, me and Danny have been working on the EV charger. And you guys remember our last video where we did a bunch of work uh, to prove out the concept. Uh, but today we did some more research and we found out that a product like this already exists. And that's totally okay. That's what Blitz is all about. Coming up with new ideas, but also validating those to make sure they're not already out in the market. And in this case, that's what happened. So on to the next one. Blitz, 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 blitz. Blitz. <laughs> hey guys, I'm Eric. Hey, I'm Nathan. And we're working on a camper. Uh, right now there's huge lead time on campers. They're extremely expensive. So we're trying to figure out a way if we can make it not those things. Yeah, the ultimate goal here is that you can go out and you can get your own trailer from a store, from Harbor Freight, from anywhere like that. You come and get our kit and then boom, you're going camping. <laughs> the, the ultimate goal right now is able to take something very simple. Uh, you can make a teardrop camper basically out of any trailer out there that you can find. And this, you can fit a full-size bed, uh, and you can take your family and go camping. So hey, my name is Isaiah Littlejohn. Uh, I'm pretty much new here to First Build. Um, 
I had this idea of trying to make large batches of herbal infused teas. One idea I had was like this um, hourglass design, which basically allows you to store uh, water in one vat and transfer it into the other. Really hold and filter whatever tea or um, tea or herbs that you, you decide to put inside of it. Blitz! What's going on everybody? It looks like Blitz Day is finally coming to a close. A lot of great ideas, a lot of energy today, but do those ideas have what it takes to become the next great innovation for the home? Well, only time will tell. But until then, as always next week, hey, thanks for watching everybody.